Hi there guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks very much for joining us again today. We've got a very short video tutorial for you that will show you how to build an e-commerce website with Weebly. Just before we get into that, once you've watched the video, you can try Weebly out for absolutely free. You can click the link down below in the description and that will take you f to a free trial version of Weebly. So if you want to give it a go after you've seen the video, then you can do so. And when you click that link, you'll be able to sign in with a Google account or an email or whatever it is that you need to sign in with, and that will bring you here to the dashboard. It'll probably boot up the um, wizard, that's the site builder, which I'm about to show you, but in case it builds, it brings you to the dashboard. Go to my site in the top right hand corner and click add site. So this is the wizard that you'll see normally when you first load Weebly, when you first log in. Obviously, if we're going for an e-commerce store, then you're going to need a website with an online store. So luckily for us, it gives us that option from the get-go. Then you can give your store a name. I'm just going to give it a test site for today's tutorial. And, you know, you could, whatever category you fall into, obviously it's not going to be a huge difference maker, these questions. Um, you could say that you're selling online. And then, you know, pick a category or... Um, you know, select other if you don't fall into one of those categories. And um, you can skip this process, you know, which I'm going to for the tutorial, but you can enter your address and the physical location of your store as well, then, if you have one. And then um, after a couple of minutes, that will build a store and bring us into the store window. So you can obviously um, sort of set up the logistics of your store, the back end of it from this point. Um, and this is the kind of dashboard in which you'll manage that with. Um, so things like a domain, items, and a payment gateway, and things like that, they're all accessible from the menu here, as you can see. Uh, so that's kind of how, how you manage the back end of the store. Um, but the site, then, you'd have to sort of open that in the editor, uh, the browser-based editor, so you can make changes to the look of your site. Um so obviously this is the first time we've we've done so by clicking that button that you just saw. Um, and it's going to allow us to choose then from the templates that are set up for e-commerce. Um, so you can obviously, you know, spend a little bit of time and, and browse the library of templates that are available to you. And find one which closest matches your kind of look and theme really. And then just evolve that into what you want. Um, I'll go for that one. Obviously you can have a, a preview of what that site will look like. And then you can start editing that site then. And that's basically the process of creating an e-commerce site done. You know, that that's it really. So um, the next stages would be then to sort of replace all the images and the text with the content that you want in your site. You could purchase a domain from an external domain name provider. And there's tutorials on how to do that on the channel as well. Um, as well as the specifics of making a, a site and the, the different aspects of it. And as you can see, you know, it's a, it's a very functional site. You can access the pages via the menu there um, and kind of, you know, look at the structure and the organization of your website like that. And if you go back for a second, that's kind of, you know, the the kind of web design based side of it. And then the uh, item sort of library that you'd create then is launched here from the dashboard um, when you click add an item. And that will take you through the sort of uh, process of building a new, a new item from scratch, add in the price, the images, the description, and that's kind of formatted through a little um, browser-based system like this, not through the actual site builder. Um, so, um, and that will sort of, you know, come out then as a as a page on the website, which is in the style and the theme of your current site, if that makes sense. Um, and yeah, that's kind of the basics of it, really. You know, so like I said, there's other tutorials on the on the channel that will cover the specifics. Um, but that's kind of how you'd put an e-commerce site with Weebly together. You'd obviously spend an extensive, a lot more amount of time than we did in the website builder, uh, kind of modifying the look and feel of the site, and and kind of you know um, developing a color palette and adding your logos and images, that's going to take quite a bit of time, as well as, you know, connecting up that domain, that's going to take 48 hours for that to, to work properly. Um, but yeah, you know, very quickly, over the course of a couple of days, you could have something up and running, you know, so uh, it's very easy, very accessible, 
everything's kind of you know single click and a menu comes up and you can easily replace the text and the images and you know it's it's very simple and intuitive so yeah and to try it out there's a link in the description down below if you've enjoyed the video and you want to see more content of this nature give us a like and subscribe to the channel and if you've got any questions or suggestions for future videos let us know in the comments down below thank you very much